Oh, f***. Show show everyone. <laughs> like in my head, I can't work the out how that would work. Like literally, I don't know how you got that out of my head. And I wanted it to feel pure magic. It was only in my head. It wasn't even like I didn't show any the camera or anything. Like nothing. I knew there was something juicy to go with it. <laughs> yeah, I know, I know. This is the bit which is like. Mm. So now that you know the secret, what do you think of it? <laughs> oh my god, it's so much better. I knew. They have to be, I knew they had to be something juicy or something more and oh my god, the method delivers way more. <laughs> it's one of those things, when I show magicians the trick, 99.99% fools. Uh, yeah. Uh, the, uh, but when I show them the secret, it's the trick that, like, they go, ugh. It's the gift that keeps on giving. <laughs> the Christmas gift. Literally, isn't it? All right, Kaylee. Yes. Then we're up. What am I doing? Skiing? Getting ready to be fooled. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay. It's time to be serious, Kale. Because I'm messing about. I'm not messing about, you are. <laughs> you're always messing about. Have you ever heard of the name Jim Steinmeier? No. Jim Steinmeier? He's a uh, one of the best magic creators in history. Okay. And he's created for the likes of David Copperfield. And I that. know him. Yeah, he no, no, yeah Copperfield. he's amazing. Yeah. So Jim Steinmeier famously once said that magicians guard an empty safe. I think it's quite a profound statement. And you can interpret it in a bunch of different ways. Yeah. Uh, how do you like interpret it? Well, it's not what's in the safe then, is it? It's, it's how you get into the safe or how you unlock it. Or... Yeah, basically, like the, we, I, I see it as, uh, I'm, yeah, and you can see it, that's Breaking right. Your answer is right. Kind of thing. It's that magicians... Um, we, we protect the secrets to the magic when really they're not the valuable part. It's more like how you like get into the safe. Like almost like the key is the secret, not what the secrets are inside. Yeah. Does okay. that make sense? Yeah. So I'm gonna try and show you um It's very profound in the morning. Quite profound, time. yeah. It's too early in the morning for this <laughs> profoundness. Uh, I'm gonna try and show you something that, a, a trick based on what I perceive that quote to mean. Okay. Alright, so I want you to turn the deck face up. And spread through the cards and just think of one card that you see, okay? And I'm not going to look. Okay. All right? And it can be any card that you want. But also, as you do that, um, remember its position as well. So the first card would be number one, second number two, and just, do, just so oh, I'll okay, explain good. why that, that's kind of important in a minute, okay? Yeah, okay. Happy? Got one? Yeah, 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 yeah. So just, and this is not set up in advance. No, no, right? no, no. Uh, you're thinking of any card in that shuffle deck. Yeah. Fair, and you know where it is exactly. Yeah. So, did I force you to think of any certain card in particular? No. No? No. I had free choice. The reason, do you know why I asked you to remember its numerical position as well? No. It's so that um, when we shuffle them again now, <laughs> like yeah. this, you can spread through and check that it's actually been shuffled into a completely different position. Okay. And that way, I don't think it could be any more fair. So you just. Um, so I get to check with, yeah. if it's Wait, not there. Take one card from the top, move it to the bottom, and count for each one to your position and check it's not there. No, it's not there. Not there? Not at all? No. All right, happy with that? Yeah. So look, shall I give the deck another shuffle? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, this is exciting. <laughs> so just to recap to everyone at home what's happened, the deck shuffled, yeah. You're thinking of uh, any card in that deck, and you checked yourself yeah. that that card has genuinely been shuffled and lost into the deck. And then we shuffled it again. Fair. Yes. Yeah, a yeah. fair shuffle as well. Yep. Not some sort of like, uh, like, it was actually like a, you always know when a magician is a real shuffle because it's, yeah. it's an overhand shuffle. I'm going to try this. Hold okay. On. Ooh. I'm not going to touch the deck, and it okay. shuffled anyway. Yeah. Is there any way that is there a, genuinely any way that I could know what this card is right now? No, this That's is it. only in my head. <laughs> I'm quite nervous. Don't be nervous because you won't get it right. <laughs> I, and I, I want every magician at home watching right now to think about what they've just seen. They've just seen a shuffled deck. Kaylee spread through the deck. She thought of any card in that deck, and the deck got shuffled up. And you checked that it was shuffled and lost in the deck, right? Yeah. How would you try and do this at home? All magicians watching. Look at me. Mm -hmm. The card you're thinking of 
Mm-hmm. Did you... you... I'm just going to go for it. Is it the Seven of Hearts? Yeah. Is it the Seven of Hearts? Yeah. Yeah. Seven of Hearts. Bang on. Yeah. You remember at the beginning? Yeah. I told you that magicians guard an empty safe. Yeah. And we said that it's not about the contents of in- inside that's important. Yeah. It's the key is the secret. Yeah. What if I told you that before this ever began? Yeah. I unquestionably knew you would choose the seven hearts. You would just think of the seven hearts. You couldn't have known that because I didn't even know when I was looking through it. I was so confident that you would choose the seven hearts that I tattooed it on myself. Shut up. Remember we said the key is the secret? Shut up. On my arm, I have a key. Yeah. I wish you guys can see at home. Oh, no but way. Hidden in the key. Oh, my God. Is? Is the secret because hidden in the key is the number 32. Right. So the okay. key is the secret. Right. Deal face up 32 cards. No way. Into my hand. No. I didn't even know I was going to pick that card. One, two, oh God, three, three four, four, five, five six, six, seven, seven eight, eight, nine, eight, nine ten, ten, eleven, eleven twelve, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fourteen fifteen, 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 sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty, thirty-one. Stop. F*** off if this is a seven of hearts. Just remember what happened. You spread to the deck. Yeah. Shuffle deck. Yeah. You thought of any card in that deck. Mm-hmm. You checked that it was genuinely shuffled into a new position. Then we shuffled it again. You never told me your card out loud. You never told me anything about your no, card. No, no one could have known that. You thinking of this? You genuinely were thinking of the yeah. seven of hearts? Yeah. I know. Because turn over the 30 second card. Oh, f*** off. Show everyone, show everyone. <laughs> <laughs> the seven of hearts. How did you do that? The key is the secret, Kim. How did you do that? All right, before 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 it um, goes out your mind, fooled. A hundred percent. A hundred percent. Because my my only go to in anything like this is like it's in stack or it's in some so sort of. All the way through. <laughs> well, you shuffled it more than once. Um, yeah, I, I, I that's brilliant. <laughs> <laughs> that is actually what brilliant. I wanted. It was a trick where I could have somebody, where I could take the deck, shuffle it up, have somebody think of any card in that deck, and then know where it was, but also have this cool reveal of that is wicked. Se- I love that reveal. Here's the secret tattooed my arm. Oh my god, that's frying my brain. I'm really trying. I right, have so no idea. I've most no fooled you have been? Yeah, that. No. I know how this works. No, wait. So wait. I know okay. how fooling it, it is. Well, it can't be in stack, and this is what this is what's frying me. <laughs> so you couldn't have known the position of my card because you didn't know what card I was thinking of. <sighs> it's not to work out. <laughs> that was such an impressive reveal, though. I loved that. I love that. Um, and same on... Oh my god, yeah. 100%. You had me hooked instantly. Creativity. It's an acan, but it's not. Yeah. It's totally not. Because it has a story. And I was excited by the whole thing. And it, it wasn't like it was a boring card trick. I was genuinely like... Entertainment. Excited and... Yeah, fine. 100%. Fine. Entertainment, creativity, cooler bonus points. I think... I think there's something very simple about the trick because it looks, it's, I perceive it as simple as a, as a layman yeah. because I think, well, all I did was I did this. It was all in my head and he knew. But I think with the limited knowledge that I have, there must be some genuine like madness or mechanic, some sort of madness <coughs> that goes with it that's really solid to do. Or like, I don't know. I think that I deserve a bonus point in itself. <laughs> that was insane. I love that. You made me love an ACAM. <laughs> Who knew? That was so good. Thank you so much. I genuinely love that.
Do you know what actually shocked me? Was it when you just came out and said, that's your card? Yeah. And I don't know fit. why, but in any other ECAN, I wasn't impressed. I'd, ne I'd never get impressed because I think that wasn't presented as an ECAN. It was presented as a story. Yeah. It was, pre and it had like, you were shuffling it constantly. That Those cards were always moving. Like in my head, I can't work the out how that would work. <laughs> like literally, I don't know how you got that out of my head. And I wanted it to feel pure magic. It was only in my head. It wasn't even, like, I didn't show any, the camera or anything. <laughs> like, nothing. I was really impressed with that. Thank you so much. Really impressed with that. Uh, Thank you for you actually like that. I really liked it. Yeah. I'm so in, I'm so Who's in. This? Like, this is mine. Oh, shut up. This is, yes. I retract yeah. all statements. <laughs> actually, this is. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> I kind of, I'm so so proud of this trick it's it's so good no, that i like i kind of want to show you the method Can, Can I I know method? Can I know when it? you see the method i think it's going to melt your brain i think it is because i honestly have no clue how and the best thing is it's a hundred okay let me show you okay i'm going to show kaylee the method really quick and she can Sorry. Be, she can be like your sort of like barometer to tell you whether it's cool or not but i love this method because it's okay. it's 100 percent surefire I, I know the card you're thinking of and it's positioned like how? from a shuffle deck all right this is the method I knew there was something juicy to go with this. <laughs> yeah, I know, I know. This is the bit which is like... Oh. Okay, so... I, got, I can shuffle again. And I can actually shuffle again. That is good. Right, so that bit's cool. That's, that's because it looks so relaxed. It looks yeah. like you're doing nothing. Because I, I am just genuinely doing what I say I'm doing. Right, which is... That's, that's the cool part. Yeah. So now... This is this is so sneaky. That's so simple. So simple. Yeah. And it's done for you. <laughs> Instead of you going seven of hearts. It's my card. That's your card. <laughs> so now with the deck being shuffled, yeah. I now know that you're exactly what your card is and, and where it's that it will be at thirty two. But there's one problem left that I have to solve. It's a hundred percent surefire, but the beauty is I'm genuinely shuffling it. Yeah. <laughs> so clever. <laughs> I... How did you work that out? <clears throat> well, we stand on the shoulders of giants, so so it's it's taking little bits of pieces I've seen from everywhere and then adding things that didn't exist for it and then reworking it all. But that's... To try and think to try and make it as that's where everything comes from, though. You know. Yeah. So you just need to reveal it any way you want. Just need to reveal it any way I want. So now that you know the secret, what do you think of it? <laughs> oh my god, it's so much better. I knew there had to be... I knew there had to be something juicy or something more and oh my god, the method delivers way more than the performance. <laughs> it's, the one performance those, it's one of those... Amazing. Thank you. Literally amazing. Well, I was a bit nervous with it because I've been doing it the old way I do this trick for eight years and I've recently just flipped it upside down completely. So I was a That's bit incredible. Honestly, there's there's just so much in it. Yeah. That as a magician, obviously I'm not, but if you've taken bits from loads of different places, obviously people are gonna know those little things as well. There might be bits of people recognising. To combine them into one trick, I just think is well. You've seen the results. It, it was incredible. Thank like, you. It was... It's one of those things. When I show magicians the trick, ninety-nine point nine nine percent are fools. Uh, yeah. Uh, the uh, but when I show them the secret, it's the trick that like they go. Ugh. It's the gift that keeps on giving. <laughs> the Christmas gift. Literally, isn't it? <laughs> because it's so self-working at certain points. Well, that's it. It is self. It's essentially like, self-working. You've got to do one or two things, and then everything else is just relaxed. Yeah. So clever. So clever. I hate saying that. <laughs> I've been doing a version of this trick for the last eight years. Yeah. And then uh, I've showed a few friends it along the way. And then... You've never showed me it. No. Well, you, you may have seen a version of this from a long time ago. Uh, actually, not long ago, I completely, after like eight years doing this, completely flipped it on its head again. Because it flipped on its head a while back. And uh, this is the, the the new version, which it's impressive. I don't know. I think I think it destroys I love that. people. Um, if you want to learn it, it's on my membership. Go to patreoncom forward slash I'll be going there so, now. <laughs> <laughs> links up in the corner or uh, in the description below. 
Um, but yeah, thank you for thank you insane. For well done, because that sh- that I have no idea how that works. I, I want I, I want I really wanted a piece of magic where I could shuffle the deck. Just say think of a card. I can't believe you just shuffle got it me multiple to times without ever knowing what it is. Yeah, and then it just be like I know exactly what your card is and to prove that I knew it ahead of time. I tattooed but that, the reveal. That. But you don't have to tattoo the reveal. You could have no. the number thirty two. You could have thirty two. You could have 32 cents on the table, or yeah. you could have 32 minutes past the hour on a yeah, watch. Yeah, that'd Anything be good. Any, any reveal. Thank you all so much for watching. If you've enjoyed this video and you want to see way more content like this, then don't forget to hit the... Subscribe button. 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 Can I do that again, but... please? No. Yes. <laughs> no. <laughs> yes! Hope you all enjoyed today's show. If you like what you see and you want to see us perform more magic, hopefully in the way, more attempts to fool Kaylee, then all you need to do is hit that... Subscribe button. And comment down below just because we want to know what you think of this video today. And uh, oh, tell them to ring the notification bell. Well, tell them. Ring the notification bell. <laughs> it's festive. It's Christmas time. You may ring, as well. Please ring the Christmas festive notification <laughs> bell. Spread some Christmas cheer. Yeah. We'll be back on Tuesday for another tutorial Tuesday and back again on Thursday for another episode of Fooler. Well, actually, mm-hmm. next Thursday, we might have a, uh, an interim guest on the show. In the form Ooh. of Peter Turner. So, Ooh. make sure you're subscribed and ready for, for that episode. It's a pretty cool one. That'd be fun. <laughs> All right. Thank you, everybody. I'll see you in the next video. Peace.